returned. I have thick eyebrows today. So yesterday, I fluffed up, and I filmed a video, and I was watching it through, and I was trying to edit it, and I really didn't like it. So I just put in like a little compilation video or whatever of like funny things from Black my phone. Um, so today is an actual video. Hello. I'm going to be telling you guys my top five Disney princesses. I'm a pretty big Disney princess fan. Disney fan in general, but like princesses. So my specialty. <laughs> Don't get crazy, all right? This is just my opinion of who the best Disney princesses are. You know what I mean? Like they're just the best. I mean, they're all great. But these ones are the best. Okay, so starting off my list at number five is Mulan, obviously. I mean, she's just badass, you know what I mean? She's just like, you know, she's badass. Like, I don't even know how to explain. Like, everyone knows how, how badass she is. See, she like almost single-handedly saved China. Okay, she didn't single-handedly do that. That's, that's false. But she, she saved China, even though people were like, don't do it. And she's like, I won't do it, and then she did it, so that alone is just like falling, you know what I mean? So Mulan, Mulan, like she's just self-explanatory, like I don't even have to like explain, because everyone knows. Okay? She should be on everyone's top five list, okay? Number four is Merida. She is Scottish, like me. She's like the ultimate tomboy. She's like kind of like the anti-Disney princess, Disney princess, you know what I mean? She's also the only Pixar princess. She is not interested in finding a man. She just wants to go and just shoot things with her arrows, which, I mean, same. Now, she has a plan for her life, and it doesn't really coincide with everybody else's plan for her, and she's just like, um, excuse me, whose life is it? It's mine. I mean, she does make some mistakes along the way, turning her mom to a bear, spoiler alert. But, um, yeah. You know, everybody makes mistakes. Everybody has those days, so. Number three is Tiana from The Princess and the Frog. Um, like, she's so underrated, like, I don't understand why people don't like, a lot of people haven't even seen this movie. <laughs> it's so good. Like, every time someone's like, oh, I haven't seen that movie, and then I make them watch it, because I make them watch it, they're like, oh my god, that's actually an amazing movie. And I'm like, I know! <laughs> Do you expect a Disney movie to be bad? Amazing character. Just amazing. Like, he's all about hard work. Okay, she's a hard-working black woman. Holla. Oh my god. Oh, I need to stop that. But she's amazing. She just wants to follow her dreams. And she'll do whatever it takes to get there, despite being, like, racially profiled. <laughs> like, can we talk? Number two is Jasmine from Aladdin. She is, like, the first Disney princess feminist. She's the only one to wear pants. Uh, the first one to be like, I am not a prize to be one. I do not want a man if I'm going to get a man. She's like, no, by Megan Trainor. That's, big. That's like her theme song. Just like, listen, I'm in charge of my own destiny. She's like... She wasn't the first one to do that, but she definitely was like, like a big contender in that kind of genre of Disney princess where they're just like, I'm in charge. I feel like that's kind of like the overall kind of thing, like theme with Disney princesses, like I'm in charge of my own fucking life, okay? And Jasmine's just amazing, sassy, sassy, the sassiest lady <laughs> ever. And of course, my number one is Ariel, obviously. She's my favorite Disney princess. A lot of people don't like her because they are like, oh, she got plastic surgery to get a man, basically. And I'm like, oh, excuse me, she actually used a man to get what she wanted in the first place, which was to be on land. Let's not forget, she wanted to be human before she ever knew what Eric was. But then she, like, saw that man. She's like, that's my ticket into this world. Oh, girl, she used a man. <laughs> Feminism. <laughs> Seriously, she's, like, an amazing character. She is, like, curious. She wants to get to the bottom of things, man, even though people are saying, oh no, you shouldn't learn that, oh no, you shouldn't do that, or like, you shouldn't be involved in that, she goes and she's like, well, why? Like, she's curious, she wants to know why she's not allowed to like certain things or go certain places, which I connect with on a personal level, thank you. And also she gets a man and her dream, like, come on, and a sequel where she has a child. She's the only Disney princess with a child. Can we talk about that for a second? Like, can we talk? about that for a second. Like, girl, Ariel's the OG. All right, so that's my top five list. Thank you guys for watching. Um, subscribe if you haven't. Like this video if you did. And comment and tell me your favorite Disney princess, obviously. Mine's obviously Ariel. Duh. But tell me yours down below. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching this mess. And subscribe for more mess. <laughs>